All right, this is the Algebra 2 Practice ELC question 33, and it says, in a large neighborhood, the values of the homes are normally distributed with a mean of $102,000 and a standard deviation of $17,000. There is a 47.5% probability that the value of a randomly selected home in the neighborhood is greater than $102,000 and less than D dollars. What is closest to the value of D? Okay, well, let's not even worry about what this part is. This is what we want to know, but let's not worry about that yet, okay? Again, it says normally distributed, so if you look in the front of your on, on your formula sheet, you're going to see a normal distribution curve, and pretty much just go ahead and try to recreate that, because it's going to help you a ton in solving this problem, okay? So I'm just going to recopy this problem here, and I think that you guys will understand this a whole lot easier once you draw this out. I know in math class they say a whole lot about, you know, you need to go ahead and work this problem out and try and draw it out. But this is actually one of those cases where it actually really does help to have it written out for you. Okay? Pretty much, it says that the mean here is 102,000. So what this means is that this number right here in the middle, your average, that's supposed to be your 102,000 dollars. And then it says that your standard deviation so every time you move over a line so every time you move over you should be increasing by seventeen thousand dollars so that means that if you increase by seventeen thousand this line here would be a hundred and nineteen thousand dollars this line here would be a hundred and thirty six thousand and this line here would be a hundred and fifty three thousand and then you can go the same way you can go in reverse this line here would be eighty five thousand this line here would be 68,000 and this line here would be 51,000 okay well most of the work for this problem has actually already been done except now just wants to know that there's a 47.5 percent probability that the value of a randomly selected home in the neighborhood is greater than a hundred and two thousand dollars okay so what's going to be close to the value well on the bottom of that chart in the front it says that the whole value of this section here is 68 percent so if you divide that 68% in half, you're going to get 34 and 34. The next section is here, and it says that the whole value of this section, of course, including this, is going to be 95%. And again, this is information that's given to you right here on your chart, so it's not like I'm some brilliant genius, because I'm not. So what you can do here is, again, divide that in half, that 95% in half, and then subtract out this 34 so you can get that the value of this is going to be 13.5 and 13.5 and then the last section here you have 99.7 so all of this here is going to be 99.7 and we'll write it over here divide that by 2 and then subtract out the 13.5 and the 34 and you're going to get 2.35 so now all you have to do is read your graph that you just created that was pretty much already given to you and it says you have to find the probability that it's going to be 47.5 percent well 34 can't even see that good times there 34 plus 13.5 is going to give you 47.5 and the price that's right here where that 47.5 percent is is D $136,000 so your answer for this one is going to be D take your time make sure you use your graph that's given to you at the beginning of this problem and this will be a piece of cake good luck